Here, let's go ahead and calculate the mode. The mode is equal to the number that occurs the most frequently in the data. Or in other words, which number here occurs the most often? If we look at these values, we see, if we count the number of values, we'll see that there's one, two, three, four values of one, one, two, two values of two, there is one, three, one, four, and one, five. So the number that occurs the most often here is the number one. So the mode is equal to one. There's another situation where you could have uh, two modes. Let's go ahead and take a look at the following example. If we have the values 1, 2, 3, 2, 1, and 4, notice in this case that the value 1 occurs two times, and the value 2 also occurs two times, but 3 and 4 only occur once. So here, there are two modes. We have a mode of 1 and a mode of 2. Okay? This is also sometimes known as bimodal.